Southern Miss is headed to the Sun Belt Conference. The school made it official today with a press conference on campus. And sports director Noah Newman joins us now with the details. Noah? Yeah, Byron. So Southern Miss will officially become the Sun Belt's 13th member on July 1st, 2023. Now, it's a move that makes a lot of sense. Commissioner Keith Gill says it's the perfect marriage. Mississippi is bordered by the conference's three states, Alabama, Louisiana, and Arkansas. So easier for fans and families. Don't have to make those trips to Texas anymore. Athletic director Jeremy McLean says they can save half a million dollars a year on travel costs and they'll get more exposure. The Sun Belt has a deal with ESPN. It made a lot of sense for our fan base. It made a lot of sense for our student athletes. Um, our, you know, as I talked to our coaches, they were all really, really excited about the, the potential. Um, as I talked to some of our key donors and board members, they were all really excited about the opportunity. Yeah, you know who's really excited is football coach Will Hall. He says the Sun Belt will be the best Group of Five conference in the country. We'll have much more in sports at six o'clock. Byron, back to you. Thank you, no excitement on the USM campus as the school is set to join the Sun Belt Conference soon. And the Sun Belt Conference started in 1976, and after more than 25 years in Conference USA, now USM is joining the Sun Belt. Honestly, I'm sort of like disappointed with how the season's gone so far. I was expecting better things with Will Hall coming in, but I'm hopeful for the last couple games. I think we'll be able to pull out a couple more wins. I'm hoping that we'll do better in the Sun Belt. Conference USA has really gone down in the past couple of years, so. I think the Sun Belt is a good thing. I think that joining this new conference is going to be really exciting. I mean, I've already enjoyed all the games we've played this year and the conference we're in right now, and I really just can't wait. I'm really looking forward to the next season. And, of course, we'll have much more coming up in sports at 6 o'clock.